Hey everybody, Iceman50 here. So uh, we're gonna take this uh, China scooter out and uh, see how it is. You can see I got tags and insurance. I got all that. Um, so it's pretty good. It's it's cheap. It was cheap. It was only like fourteen dollars for uh, insurance on this thing. Now I didn't. Uh, I didn't opt for any uh, collision or anything like that. It's only, uh, I think it's only worth 600 bucks. But I did get the uh, higher, since my son's gonna be riding this, I did get the, uh, the higher um, insurance on the, uh, uh, I usually do like on my car, I do the uh, 100, 300, 100, so it's like $100,000 per person, per incident, $300,000 bodily or uh, property damage, whatever. And then, uh, so on this one, I did 250, 500, 100, I think. And I'm probably gonna do the same thing with my bike because if, uh, if something happens, um, you know, it's 250 bodily injury, you know, um, uh, you can see all the condensation inside of some of this stuff. We got to figure out what's going on with the front brake. This thing has no front brakes. It, it's got the hydraulic brake. You can see here, it's got the hydraulic brake. Um, and I think the reservoir is right up here. But uh, I think what we're going to have to do is crack the bleeder. Uh, maybe when... Uh, Trevor gets home, he's out right now uh, with my wife. They do this, uh, you know, I told you she sells jewelry and stuff, so they're downtown in Batavia right now. Um, one of the big things is that we need to figure out the fuck is going on with this. Uh, they really, the previous owners really like, <laughs> didn't put it back. They were not mechanically inclined. So, um, but yeah, we'll wipe off the seat here. And uh, we'll take this finger for a ride. Now, the one issue that it does have, so you got the, the front brakes, which you can see there's just, there's nothing there. So uh, the other issue is the headlights and stuff. I think, so when you ride this thing, the lights are very dim and then uh, sometimes they work and as you speed up, they get brighter. You know, I don't know if you guys know, but when you see stuff like that, that's that's a voltage regulator. Basically, the uh, stator is like an AC motor or a generator, right? And uh, just like everything else that puts out AC, uh, you got to turn it into DC. That's what the rectifier is for. Basically, it's just a, 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 a very heavily packaged uh, bridge rectifier. So AC comes in and DC comes out. So, uh, you know, I was doing some, some searching and... I think the uh, I think the regulator on this thing is toast. Uh, we could. And what's weird is it's only the headlights and something else. There's not everything else is on is off of like the 12 volt system. So there's a separate winding on the on the uh, stator for the for the starter, and then there's a separate winding uh, or two actually for uh, other electrical. So. You know, we could, uh, you know, bypass that and I want to get some LED lights and stuff. We could definitely, you know, put some LED lights up here and that's what we want to do. So in the back, you know, we'll get a LED bulb um, and I think that'll fit right in, right in here. So just a few little things, uh, really to me, it's the brakes and the electrical so that you can ride it at night, you know. So let's, uh, you can see we got this thing in. We got a decent amount of gas. Turn it on. With these, you gotta um, okay. Uh oh. Did uh, <laughs> this isn't good. God damn it. 
did we see horn works? Blinkers. Ah, oh, yeah, you gotta, you gotta love that. The yeah, blinkers work, right? I think they work in the back too. I hope so. Yeah. Let's check before we. Oh, you know it's it's got that goddamn. Um, this is what fucked us up at Menards. When we went over to Menards, I was like, hey, what the hell? It's not starting. There's, I guess, um, it will not start with the uh, kickstand down, which I guess is good, but let's uh, let's verify that. So when we pick this up, there's a stupid little dummy light here that uh, should come on. All right, everybody, let's... Uh, Let's take a look and see what the hell's going on here. I, uh, <laughs> I have no idea. One thing that I did want to show you guys, you're not going to be able to see it from here, but uh, the intake for this thing, there's a boot here. This boot is all, here, it's right here. This intake boot is all ripped open. It's not even basically coming from the filter, right? Which is pretty sad right so and some of the locks on this thing don't work uh, let's see if I can get a lock too because uh, yeah there's there's no locks uh, this this lock up front isn't functioning so And I think, <laughs> I think that's where all that crap is at in this, this, uh, this here, this, you can see it's, it's not very happy. Ow. bending that key I don't think so hey there we go we got it free oh, let's see here mm-hmm yeah huh. what do we got in here a little little extra cash this is from the, the lady that oh snap there's some there's some money in here See, what do we got? Jesse White. Okay. What is this? Get, ah, fuck, my knee. Ah, let's see. What do we got in here? We have, ooh, it's like dusty money. We have three dollars. Okay, and 50 cents. gas money oh, so, man we got all these bumblebee insurance okay okay all this needs to go away we'll just throw that in there temporarily Well, I'm glad that I got that open, but <laughs> the electrical's not in there either. Uh, okay. All right, everybody. We're going to go to Menards. Find some screwdrivers. Um, now I got to look at that stupid switch for the starter because uh, it did flicker on one more time but something's something's up with that there we had an issue the last time we tried to run it so get a 
screwdriver that you can keep in there and I need a new one. I really like the Klein tenon ones. They're pretty handy. Um, man, it's getting cold out here. Woo! Definitely need some extra. What are you waiting for, buddy? We're gonna come park. everybody I'll see you back at the crib all right hang on all right let's see again if we can oh and I like the there's a beer can right under the back wheel of this fucking car over here I don't know who, who's doing that kind of shit but you know you wreck a tire that way as long as it ain't my t as long as it ain't my car Still foobar. Well, you can see it's not until I there's something up with the brake and then you know you can see that the uh, the switch there uh, yeah oh, these these mirrors are totally fucked <laughs> well, let's see if we can uh, <laughs> oh, I keep forgetting it's a scooter I'm <laughs> gonna rev it up and <laughs> All right, let's see what happens here. <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, I forgot. <laughs> I went to go grab the front brakes and there's nothing there. <laughs> oh my God. That's a horrible looking Hyundai Elantra. <laughs> you know this thing ain't too this thing ain't half bad. Okay? I don't know, it's weird having your feet up like this. It's so weird not doing anything with your feet. Uh, it's kind of frightening actually because it's not like a bike you know it s seems to roll really good it runs fine you definitely gotta gotta mash on that pedal go this way. I just wanted to see how this thing rode. The controls are in a relatively same place for the uh, for the scooter as it is on the ground. At least the uh, turn signals. Let's uh Take it out on the street. Like, it 
It's so weird. I mean, <laughs> fucking mirrors are all jangly and janky. <laughs> Jesus It's definitely different than a motorcycle You can see I leaned a lot there To come around the corner And it was like whoa I had to put my foot down Yeah I can see how he doesn't like the um, <laughs> The speedometer Because you don't really know It's in fucking kilometers per hour I can't really tell We need to uh, <laughs> You're definitely going to need a, a speedometer app on your phone. Oh my god. This thing is fucking hilarious. I mean, <laughs> it's not the fastest thing in the world, but this thing will get you moving. Really? What the fuck, dude? Scooter gang! I really don't know how fast I'm going. I, it says 40 something. <laughs> Get away from me! <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, the speedometer is great. I don't even know why they give you a fucking tack because you don't need it. You really don't. Man, I go, I go to keep stepping on the foot and the handbrake. Oh, God. This thing takes a lot. We got to definitely get these front brakes working. This is uh, <laughs> a little sketchy. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, that's hilarious. <laughs> Guys like Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> oh man. Well, now that, that see that brick switch is working now. Get it. We'll get it back home. Come on. Suck like you've never sucked before. Honestly, I, I can't, you can't be doing 50. There's, there's no fucking way that was 50. I mean, I know this thing goes 50. Just keep your hand covered on the rear drum brake. <laughs> you can lean on this thing. It's <laughs> if this is all I had, this would be good enough. Honestly, it's not that horrible. It's a little wonky. Yeah, see now that now that brake switch is working. All right, turn it off. Turn it on. Yeah, see. Well, the brake switch is working. Hmm. <laughs> Remember, it's got a CVT. Yeah, I think we definitely got to obviously take care of that intake issue, right? And, uh... <laughs> okay, see? So, can we turn this off? Okay, no brake. Okay, brake switch. On. See? Oh, but you can't start it. <laughs> okay. 
So the kickstand has to be up in order to start. That's kind of messed up, to be honest with you. I, I can't really believe we were doing 45. I don't know, man. Let's uh, let's pull out my. Uh, fuck is my phone? Well, uh, okay, so I left my phone inside. All right, that's kind of scary. All right, all right. Well, let's. Uh, uh, let me go get um. My uh, my action camera. We got the screwdrivers. Let's uh. Let's start tearing into this thing. I, I think I think our voltage regulator is bad. Uh, we'll grab my meter and uh, we'll see. But and then you know what? Let's let's do this first. Let's get my phone and then we'll see how fast we're actually cruising. And because uh, that's what I really want to know. Iceman 5.0 here. So uh, we're here, we're outside, and uh, I got the uh, schematic for this thing. And uh, 